हेलो एवरीवन लेट्स स्टार्ट टू डिस्कशन क्वेश्चन नंबर वन वेयर वाज द फर्स्ट सेशन ऑफ कंस्टिट्यूएंट असेंबली हेल्ड आंसर इज न्यू दिल्ली देन क्वेश्चन नंबर टू हु वाज द चेयरमैन ऑफ यूनियन कंस्टिट्यूशन कमिटी ऑफ द कंस्टिट्यूएंट असेंबली आंसर इज जवाहरलाल नेहरू क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री हुईच प्रोक्लेम प्रोक्लेमशन ऑफ नेशनल इमरजेंसी ऑटोमेटिकली सस्पेंड्स आंसर इज राइट टू फ्रीडम इन दिस प्रोक्लेमशन ऑफ नेशनल इमरजेंसी ऑटोमेटिकली सस्पेंड्स दैट इज राइट टू फ्रीडम देन फ्रेंड्स क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर on the basis of financial crisis how many times has the emergency been declared by the president of india answer is not even once ek hi bar ek bhi bar nahi hua hai on the basis of financial crisis india mein ek hi bar emergency nahi hua hai reason is financial crisis so next question number 5 what type of party system has been evolved in india answer is multi party इंडिया में मल्टी पार्टी सिस्टम इवल्व होता है देन क्वेश्चन नंबर सिक्स हुईच पोस्ट डज द कंस्टिट्यूशन ऑफ इंडिया डज नॉट मेंशन आंसर इज द डेपुटी प्राइम मिनिस्टर जो डेपुटी प्राइम मिनिस्टर पोस्ट है इसमें ये पोस्ट कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन ऑफ इंडिया में मेंशन नहीं है देन क्वेश्चन नंबर एट सॉरी सेवन Who decides the number of judges in a high court? Answer is president. President decides the number of judges in a high court. Then question number eight: With which does the power to extend or restrict the jurisdiction of the high court rest? Answer is with the parliament. Then question number nine: Who appoints? the chief election commissioner of india answer is president we know president appoints the chief election commissioner of india then question number 10 who said i therefore want freedom immediately this very night before done if it can be had this is the statement was given by mahatma gandhi then question number 11 up to how much age can the members of the union public service commission function answer is 65 years then question number 12 which country has the briefest constitution in the world answer is usa united states then question number 13 who was made the home minister when jawaharlal nehru formed the interim government in 1946 answer is sardar patel then question number 14 which committee was assigned to recommend reforms in the insurance sector answer is malhotra committee then question number 15 what is the minimum permissible age for employment in any factor or mine answer is 14 years so 14 years is the minimum permissible age for employment in any factor or mine then question number 16 who is competent to prescribe conditions as for acquiring indian citizenship answer is parliament then 17 when the vice president acts the as president he gets the emoluments of which post answer is president then question number 18 the resolution for removing the vice president of india can be moved in which sabha only in rajya sabha so the vice president resolution or removing of vice president resolution of india only can be moved in rajya sabha next question number 19 to whom does the public accounts committee submit its report public accounts committee kisse report submit karti hai ya karta hai the speaker of lok sabha answer is the speaker of lok sabha 
then 20 which is the highest and final judicial tribunal in respect of constitution of india answer is supreme court we know supreme court is the highest and final judicial tribunal in respect of the constitution of india next 21 which union territory attained statehood in february 1987 answer is goa goa union territory has been attained statehood remember that is in that was in february 1987 then question number 22 which article of the constitution of india makes a specific mention of village panchayats answer is article 40 under article 40 constitution of india makes a specific mention of village panchayats next question number 23 which amendment of the constitution of india deals with the issue of, st of strengthening of panchayati raj that is 73 or 73rd amendment of constitution of india that deals with the issue of strengthening of panchayati raj then 24 what does the permeable of our constitution contain that is the spirit of the constitution then question number 25 the source of India's sovereignty lies in which thing that is, that is permeable to the constitution then 26 when the president vice president acts as president he gets the emoluments of which post we already know the answer is president next 27 in who in India the concept of single citizenship is adopted from which country remember it's from england question number 28 in which year was the first no co confidence motion moved in the Lok Sabha after independence answer is 1963 then 29 from where can a member of parliament claim immunity from civil cases only answer is from civil cases only then last question question number 30 with which the executive power relating to concurrent subjects remain that is answer is center thank you so much for watching please like share and subscribe my channel